Hey guys, it's Rosalind and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm really excited about this video for two main reasons. Um, one being I have been wanting to do this for a really long time and I just haven't because it's just felt really daunting. Um, like really, really months and months and months. And then two, this is my first collab video. So I am collaborating with a sweet gal that I met um, in an actually a blogging course. And so we are doing a mutual decluttering video together so I will be linking a little clip of her video for you to check out um, she's really really sweet her name's Ellie Hurst I think I'm saying that right um, and I'm just so excited so definitely check out her video too and I hope you enjoyed this video basically I announced that we were pregnant we were really excited and even though I am not 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 the kind of person that does stuff in advance at all like I said, I have just like, my son's closet is stressing me out. His clothes are like, just were thrown in bags and boxes. And so I just kind of want to like do an inventory of everything that he has. Um, just to kind of figure it out what we have, what we may need, what like didn't make it through the first round, um, and all the things. So again, normally I'm not this advanced uh, or like, plan in advance because we're only like just in the second trimester but again this has just been something I've been wanting to do and I'm like now is the perfect time huh yeah so should we organize okay you want to help me okay so this might actually take us and mean for sure it's going to take us a couple days so this will be a video montage of multiple days pulled together because there's no way I'm getting it done today huh but Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. I always think it's like really inspiring watching these decluttering videos, um, really just because it helps me lit a fire, light a fire to declutter. So I actually watch several videos to be like, I can do this, I can do this. So anyway, let's do this. So yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you are cute. Huh? You are cute. Bye. Bye. So this is mostly the thing I want to tackle. It's just, it's, I don't even know. So I'm like going to pull everything out. And then I also pulled out boxes from the attic of all of his stuff when like he was smaller. I just want to organize it. I mean, this is like a box I started, not these, of like nursing things that I want. Like bottles and just stuff that I think we'll use at my pump earlier on. Some like baby clothes. So like I said, this closet is just... Ugh. So excited to make it less scary. Not gonna lie, don't really know where to start. Like, do I start with the boxes that are already kind of organized? I think so. I think that's something I can accomplish by the time Daniel gets off work, because then we're hoping to go for a walk before the sun goes down. It still goes down so early. So let's do that. like bag you saw and this is like newborn zero to three months three to six months six to nine months and like accessories all right here's even like more clothes that i pulled out of this closet and these two things you just like making messes as you just stuff on the clothes all right well let's tackle this bunch Halloween costumes, 12 months, like accessory baby stuff. That's our six to nine months, three to six months, zero to three months, and newborn. So piles are growing and they were totally all kinds of mixed up.
Hey guys, so I definitely stopped um, for like a week. I was doing really good progress on my son's room slash future nursery and pretty much came to a halt. So it is Saturday, trying to get back at it. Um, so I will show you the somewhat progress we made. So my son has clearly played, but I got everything organized in the containers. I still need to organize this, which is a mix of like, you know, baby stuff, just trying to prep for when baby comes, what I need immediately, what I won't need, like this. I think that can go in one of the bins. So anyway, and haven't really made progress on the closet or his drawers, so lots to do. Oh. It is so much more organized. I'm still not done yet, but everything is just, I know what it all is now and I can access it and it just feels way less chaotic. So I still have to go through all of this, but I'm about to put my son down for a nap. So I'm gonna go move that into our room so I can organize it. And then I think I might actually rearrange his room too because I'm just kind of ready for a change, but progress. all my pumping supplies and found size three diapers so I think I officially have everything done my son is napping so there's a few like I need to do kind of like the last sweep but I think I finally have everything organized which feels amazing um, just knowing that when this baby comes this next baby that everything is in bins and it's organized I have two bins here that I'll unbox and wash um, before baby's due date. And then just the closet is so much more organized. Like I know where diapers are, I know where wipes are, I know where Malachi's like extra toys and books and everything are. And it's all like put away cause Malachi things were just like thrown in the closet. And now it's like organized where he's less likely hopefully to pull things out. So I'm really excited to wrap this up. This has been literally on my list of things I've been dreading doing. Um, 
for months really probably like close to since when he was born because it was just I never organized it it was like originally kind of organized we just shoved stuff as we got it and um, now it feels so much <sighs> So I'll report back after he wakes up. In the meantime, I really do think I'm gonna take a nap. Hey guys, it's the final day hopefully of uh, doing Malachi's room and organizing the nursery. I have the closet done. I need to go through all his drawers and I'm actually gonna rearrange real quick. And then I'll think So it already looks so much better. Also gonna hang up some decor. I have Malachi happily reading right now. So, let's do it! so good I cannot believe I have like literally I think this is the first time in Malachi's room actually feels pulled together I like hung stuff up which I've been meaning to do I had a few things hung up but not really and I just like there's just all these little cute like corners things feel organized so I'm getting ready to show y'all the full tour you walk in we have his dresser and everything's organized and Gotta hang up this little corner, move the crib over here, have just kind of this little like reading nook with some of his rings. It's kind of like the one toy he plays with. And then Daniel hung up this coat rack, which I'm really excited about. And then, dun dun dun, his closet, which still has a lot of stuff in it, but this is all stuff that he'll be like coming into, like bottles and like these little, like snack cups and um, this I have left out because that's just like a car seat cover for the next baby. These are like clothes he'll be growing into. Again, nursing um, pillow for the next baby. These are all books, all of these that we'll just swap out. And like a lot of the ones down here are paper books, but um, it's just easier for me to have them stored. And then here's like more board books that will rotate out, toys that we rotate out. Um, and then over here, like more cloth diaper stuff, regular diaper stuff, and then just some more, there's more toys in there, his pack and play blankets, but everything is organized and feels just so, so good. Like I said, I have been wanting to get this done for forever. Thank you guys so much for watching. Honestly, this was like such a good motivator for me personally to get this done. Cause like I've mentioned many, many times, this has been something I've been putting off and it just feels so good to kind of have Malachi's room finally pulled together, have stuff for baby organized and ready so that we can easily pull it. And even though we haven't figured out exactly what we're gonna do um, once baby moves out of our room, I just feel like we're organized and it's, just gonna be so much easier so anyway I hope you enjoyed this video definitely check out Ellie's video as well I'll have the links down below and I would just love to know um, when you were pregnant did you go through a nesting period if you had a second pregnancy did it hit way earlier like I guess it has for me where I'm just like I need to get all the things organized now um, with Malachi it definitely didn't hit until like 
seven or eight months where I was like, shoot, he's coming and I don't have anything ready. So not shoot, he's coming, but just, I was excited for him to come, but I just didn't have things ready. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next time.